OJ, OJ Simpson back in court to get out of jail. ABC's Neil Karolinski was in the courtroom with Simpson yesterday, and he joins us now. Good morning, Neil. George, good morning. OJ Simpson, who, according to police reports, weighs in at a whopping 270 pounds, came into court here yesterday looking a lot less like the former All-Star and more like just another aging prisoner. He'll be back here in court this morning, essentially trying to convince the judge to give him a second chance. The big moment in this hearing will likely come on Wednesday when O.J. Simpson himself is expected to testify under oath, something he never did in either of his now infamous criminal cases. George? Okay, Neil, thanks very much. And for more on this, let's bring in one of the country's top defense attorneys, Roy Blackroy. Thank you for joining us this morning. So O.J. testifies on Wednesday. What's he going to have to do there to get this get-out-of-jail-free card? Well, he has to play the, the really the points that he has. One, that the lawyer misinformed him before he went in there to get back the memorabilia. Two, he wasn't told about the plea bargain. And three, he didn't get his chance to testify and somehow his lawyer interfered with that. Those are the big three points he's going to have to make. But of course, you're going to have his lawyer come back uh, and testify as, as well. And presumably, he's going to have some records. Well, yes, number one, I'm sure that Yale Galanter has a file in which he has notes about informing Simpson about his plea bargain. Um, I'm sure that he has denied, he told him in advance he could go ahead and do this because no lawyer is going to give somebody advice like that. And I think on Friday, I think the really big day is Friday when Yale Galanter takes the stand. Simpson has to waive the attorney-client privilege, so he's going to be able to tell the entire story about the background of that trial. And, and that could end up making Simpson even more vulnerable. Oh, yeah. Once you waive the attorney-client privilege, you open Pandora's box. You don't know what the lawyer is going to say because Yale has the right to defend himself from these accusations. And he has the right to tell what he told him and what Simpson told him about what happened. So bottom line, does O.J. have much of a chance here? I would say that his chances are somewhere between zero and one percent. Wow. <laughs> guess wow. that's not much of a chance, okay? No, no. It's, it's pretty slim. Okay. Roy Black, thanks very much.